Well, John, Dwayne Wade says he will play tonight. I spoke to his agent who said the same thing, but he did say they've been working all day to rehydrate Wade. And Pat Riley just confirmed for us that Wade was taken to a local hospital this morning to get some IV. But even then, Riley downplayed the seriousness of the situation. That is the best place to do it, to put you know, water in them, <laughs> to bring them to my house, you know. <laughs> You know, I mean, you, you know, if you think about it, we would have sent, you know, a bunch of doctors to his house, but they would have said, well, we didn't bring any IVs for this, so we better take him somewhere. So we decided to be very proactive with this and just put a lot of fluids in him, yeah. Riley's been in this situation before. He actually coached Magic Johnson when he had the flu much worse than Wade, he said, in a game against Detroit in 1998, 1988, excuse me. Michael Jordan, of course, in 1997, lifted the Bulls over Utah with that 38-point performance. The little kid in Chicago watching that game, Dwayne Wade. So he may be inspired by that tonight. Of course, if the Heat are looking for other inspiration, they can go to the middle of their locker room. We've been reporting all week on the mysterious objects appearing there. There's a new one tonight. So far, when they've had something there, they've won the game. We'll have to see, John, if it works for them this evening.